Fast as wind and quick as fire make up a formidable boss duo that you encounter right after the Grey Bronze Cart battle. A common mistake many players make is rushing into this fight without first returning to the nearest shrine to heal up from the previous encounter. However, I charged in and managed to defeat the duo on my first attempt, so you might find success too. This encounter requires a lot of dodging. The tricky part is managing to keep track of both bosses at once. Each one is relatively easy to damage, stagger, and dodge when alone. Together, they can be a bit bothersome, but if you keep them both in your line of sight and focus on one at a time, you should be able to handle the challenge without too much trouble. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content on Black Myth Wukong and other exciting games. <laughs>
charmer, aren't you, boy? But these eyes have seen prettier disguises. Yao Guai! Your true face! Out with it! If a single lie slips, my rake shall strike true! <laughs> that was so close. Thank you for saving me. I am the Bull King's daughter, Ping Ping. Oh, nonsense! The Bull has no daughter! Dare to fool me, scoundrel! <laughs> I... I know who you are! My mother is Princess Fairfox. You killed her! After my mother died, I've been living with my father. His wife, Princess Rikshasi, took me in as her own. Later, brother came back from Bodhisattva Guan Yin, and we reunited. We had some peaceful days. My brother was kind, to me and to our parents. But somehow, not long ago, he suddenly changed. He secretly summoned his old troops for a coup, imprisoned father, kept mother under strict watch. I... I had nowhere else to turn. I had to go for help. But barely after leaving the place, his minions fell upon me. <laughs> the Bull King's might is known. Even together, Wukong and I couldn't rival him. Rakshasi's plantain fan is also formidable. And you want me to believe that they were subdued by a kid? Subdued by their son? Who else could make them put their guard down? Really, with soft hearts, they could never harm him. You idiot! This fox is fooling you! Look at this place! Only my brother's Samadhi fire could wreak such havoc! Oh no. My father is dying. Please, kind monkey, help me and my family! A perilous place this is. Keep this cicada safe with you. It'll come in handy. That's a voice I know well. I'll go ahead and take a look. No time to lose now! <laughs> 